Whether they are in the NBA 2K League or PlayStation 24 7, mostly have the same build that I'll be showing you guys today. It is a 6 1 build that is mainly an offensive threat. And you guys should have no issue with putting the ball in the hoop because I'll also be giving you guys my dribble animations along with my jump shot as well. So make sure you guys stay until the end of the video so you do not miss out on that. Let's get right into it. Starting off with the position of the player, we'll be making it a point guard. The hand is his preference. I usually do left handers. The height of this player is a 6 1. We give it ourselves a lowest weight and a wingspan of 6'7 so we can get a 92 three-pointer because if we if we go 6'8, as you guys can see, it drops us to 91. So we'll be doing a 6'7 wingspan. Body shape can either be slight or compact. First for finishing, we'll be giving ourselves an 86 driving dunk, which will give us limitless takeoff on gold. And you get silver posterizer and silver slithery finisher as well. We'll be giving ourselves an 80 layup just in case we get taken out of some like dunk animations we make sure that you know what i'm saying we will, you know what i'm saying if we get taken out the animation we will still make the, the layup if it does happen we get giant slayer on go on hall of fame realist finisher on silver and we also get acrobat on silver we'll be giving ourselves a 59 close shot so we can get 19 finishing badges instead of 18. on to the shooting we'll be giving ourselves a 92 three-pointer along with an 80 mid-range which which will leave us at 24 shooting badges I upgraded my free throw on this build. You guys don't have to, but I made it a 77 just in case, you know, for rec, um, comp program, you know what I'm saying, stuff like that so I don't miss my free throws. Um, we get 25 shooting badges. We get gold limitless range, gold blinders, Hall of Fame amped, Hall of Fame guard up, you know what I'm saying? We get good shooting badges, y'all, especially we have 25, so, you know what I'm saying? We should be shooting lights out, you know what I'm saying? Next, for playmaking, this is the best part of this build. As you guys can see, we get a 97 ball handle which gives us Hyper Drive Hall of Fame. Quick first step, we already get Hall of Fame. Hall of Fame Unpluckable, which is perfect against Lockdown like the Spam X. Hall of Fame Unpluckable, Hall of Fame Clan Breaker, and Hall of Fame Killer Combos, which speeds up your dribble move. So these badges are very key to have, especially on Hall of Fame tier. But 83 speed with ball, so we can get 22 playmaking badges. And our passing accuracy will be going up to an 85. I don't like slow passes, y'all. I hate, hate when my, my passes be floating around. Like it's getting carried by the wind or something. For defense, we're going to give our perimeter defense up to a 50. Offensive rebound going to go to a 35. But this build is mainly for 3v3, 5v5. I don't really use this build on a 2v2 court or 1's court because, you know what I'm saying, I don't have defense. So why would I, you know what I'm saying, why would I do that to myself? You know what I'm saying? But the speed of this player is going to be at 80, so we're not slow off ball. We can bait out the corner and get back to our man. I would say have your acceleration to at least like a 94 plus. You know what I'm saying? I haven't really made any small guard with it under a 94 acceleration, if you know what I'm saying. Acceleration is very important this year, y'all. We're giving ourselves a 99 stamina. I, mean, I don't really run out of stamina, especially if you use the, um, the double bars, the double Gatorade bars too, especially with Gym Rat. we be giving ourselves an 85 vertical so we can get contact dunks. And as you guys can see, our badge count is 19, 25, 26, and 1. I put my plus badges mainly on my playmaking. I'm saying you can never go you can never go wrong with, with more playmaking you feel me? You, you do not need no um you do not need more finishing you do not need more shooting and you definitely do not need defense so I would just say just put it on playmaking next for the takeovers all these takeovers are good but the takeover that I use now I would say I would say definitely limitless range and you could either use easy blow buys finishing moves or team ratings boost takeover boost it doesn't really matter i don't really use a shot creator but we'll go with the finishing moves you know what i'm saying since the offensive build slashing build you know what i'm saying i definitely do recommend you guys make this player it has shades of damian lillard De'Aaron fox but yeah let's get right into the jump shot and the dribble move y'all for my dribble style i use michael jordan signature size up i use steve francis size up escape package i use trey young and the moving crossover that i use right now currently is russell westbrook or you guys could use James Harden if you guys feel like it. James Harden gives you a faster snatchback animation. Pro behind the back, basic moving spin. Moving hesitation, I use pro. Or you guys could use Zach Levine, doesn't really matter. Moving step back, I use normal for the Asta slide. If you guys do not know, the Asta slide is that move right there. Um, And triple threat style, I use Michael Jordan. I don't really use that, but you know what I'm saying? Passing style is LeBron James. Let's get right, let's get right into the jump shot. Huh? Alright, so with this jump shot, I use Kevin Porter Jr. 
Afroni Simmons and Ish and Ish Smith. I recommend you guys either try if you guys do not like Kevin Porter base, I recommend you guys try Stephen Curry. I swapped them bases out. I either use Kevin Porter Jr. or Stephen Curry. But when it comes to consistency, definitely Stephen Curry is the way to go. But if you guys like a faster jump shot, like a like a quick jump shot to get off quicker, I definitely I definitely recommend you guys try out Kevin Porter Jr. If you guys did not know, I also have a 6'6 demigod that I just dropped. You guys most definitely go check it out. And if you guys stayed through the whole end of the video and you guys enjoyed the video, please do not forget to like, comment, and subscribe. It's your boy Splash and I'm out.